I'm gonna think if you get your eyebrows microbladed. I think you should get this is your sign to get your eyebrows microbladed. It is. It hi guys good morning welcome to my youtube channel i'm up really early because i have a 9 a.m appointment today i'm supposed to get my nails done i'm supposed to get the second phase of my microblading done and then i'm going to grab something at the mall so stay tuned if you want to see that Tamara now, um, like Fort Lauderdale area. Oh yeah, Dutch boy. That's where I'm gonna have the um, microblading done. I got here a little earlier than anticipated, so gonna get something to eat. I can't have coffee or anything. You can't have coffee. You can't have painkillers, any of those things. Cause she said what it does is that it thins your blood, and when them stroke the eyebrow then it starts to bleed profusely she said one time she did it and the lady was just bleeding out she couldn't finish it so i'm not even like a coffee person like that anyway but i'm just reminding myself to not get coffee or anything so probably like a sandwich i don't really like american breakfast to be very I retract that. I don't like breakfast in general. I'm not a breakfast person. I'm not a get up and eat person. I'm struggling right now because I do not even should be in my bed. I don't wake up until like 12, 1 o'clock anyway. But um, it was this or 5 p.m. tomorrow. I didn't want it to be 5 p.m. tomorrow. So, yeah. If I did 5 p.m. tomorrow, it would have taken me way into the night. I didn't want that. So, yeah, so I think I'm gonna grab some breakfast from Chick fil A because I'm hungry. I kind of need from yesterday afternoon, and then hopefully, um, I will show you guys when I get there. That, that is the Chick fil A line. We cannot, we can't go in. There's no way I'm gonna end up being late, and I don't want that. Is that them not have egg and bread at them yard? The chokehold. The chokehold that Chick fil A have on these people who live in these United States of America, it is it is beyond me. But I think I might be in that choke. I don't. I wouldn't say I'm in that chokehold because my non join any any line for that. Like, it's good, you know. It's good, and uh, sometimes I eat it. I feel like it runs a comparison to KFC, but. Me not join that Jamaican KFC because KFC up here is <laughs> but and I don't want to be late because it don't take a while and she have a number bros and etc etc so yeah I don't know again I'm gonna have to figure out something else so this is what I ended up having okay so you can see her work area right here it's so cute i love the quotes and the stuff on the wall and i really like coming here i love the ambience and there i'm in the mirror <laughs> yeah this is also her workstation and equipment for the day all right guys so we're basically finished now which is like as i had estimated 
like two and a half hours later so this is the final thing now so Perfect shape. That's true. That's so true. It's so true. Here you go. Mm -hmm. So, this is the final thing. One bro, two bro. So, Yes. It's the same heating process again, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, you're not going to look like this tomorrow. <laughs> they eventually look like this when it's healed up again. But this is like the first step of getting them healed and everything again. So this is the final thing. So, yeah. These are my brows, so hopefully it will retain well. I don't want to have to come back and know, but for now, this is the doll. Period. Bye. Let us talk about my eyebrows. Let me tell you this. I wanted to get my eyebrows microbladed from 20 19 it was either not the time or it was just not in the budget for whatever reason and then there was this girl who was doing the sale in jamaica on the rose and i don't know i just never got around to doing it and then um as i said i this year i want to get into kind of just more convenience and efficiency i do not i can't bother for like just like look at how I'm not wearing any makeup or anything, any lashes, anything, and I could go somewhere now because you just look kind of just so ready to go. So I will be the first to admit that it is it is not the cheapest, but think about it. If you're going to have these for two years, it kind of does work out and the healing process is not the easiest, but that's like a week, a couple, a couple of days, and then you just get to look like this <laughs> all the time. So... I think if you get your eyebrows microbladed, I think you should get this is your sign to get your eyebrows microbladed. It is, it is, it is your sign to get your eyebrows microbladed. And honestly, when I think about it, um, it was a little the you would think that to pay the amount to get your eyebrows microbladed one time is a lot, but you kind of spend that in tens and twenties and thirties, anyways. You kind of do so if you want to shorten your routine your makeup routine or you just want to look you know just have that look all the time that put together look all the time i think you should get your eyebrows microbladed i think you should if you think too that lashes are uh, expensive um if you think lashes are kind of expensive to do every two weeks this kind of really do something to your face so if you can't keep up with the lashes you have this all the time so excited to take you guys through the i don't know if i'm gonna show you the healing process because it is <laughs> it is not the cutest so i might take photos and insert them but in videos but not like a video i'm not sure as yet but this is your sign to get your eyebrows microbladed. It is. Period. Yes. So I ended up actually finally getting the Chick fil A for lunch. So that's some nuggets and Chick fil A sauce and some fries. My fave. Alright, so I'm at the mall now. I want to get something at Victoria's Secret and then get something from Aldo. So, um, I don't think I'm going to do a lot of talking inside, but I'll at least try to show you the stuff that they have now. And, yeah, right? 
so i'm walking into the mall the pink is actually separate from the victoria secret but i'm just gonna go ahead and look have sweats for 35 not bad because it's normally like 60 so just showing you around some undies it's a good price too five for 32 um and it's actually pretty comfortable i can tell you that they are pretty comfortable and their sleepwear is comfortable too so it's really these are really good christmas ideas if you're in the market for that i have quite a few stuff from here so i can say that it might be a little bit on the pricier side but it's not too bad then i went over to aldo aldo is one of my favorite store for shoes or bag I have quite a few stuff from them. Most of my bags are from them. I find that their stuff are so unique and cute. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my goodness. It can be a little bit underpriced yes, I because those can run for like a hundred dollars. For the shoes, those are nothing under 90. But as you see, I love how they're going with the matching bags and shoes and the colors. They're just to die for. I love them. Look at that. It matches with the bag up top. So as you can see, bunch of cute stuff. I'm looking for a black bag. It's supposed to be available here. So that's what I'm just looking around. But their stuff is always so cute. I can never just come in and look for what I have. Plus, I like to shop overall. So I always like to look at new stuff. I like this. It's cute. I like the chain on it. That's another cute bag. My everything bag. And I'm um, just continuing to look around and I love that color. But I'm being a little more budget friendly so I don't just buy things because I like them. I need to see the purpose of what I'm getting. This is the bag that I like. It's, I like it but I don't love it. And that's another thing. I don't want to spend on what I don't love. So I didn't actually end up getting it. This is Victoria's Secret which is separate so I can't use the coupon I have these bags are cute but uh, not quite what i'm looking for so i just kind of look around because i always like the ambience of victoria's secret so time to get my nails done so here i didn't get them done from the previous day because the person wasn't sure so um i want to get a french set so hopefully it turns out how i want i like this artist a lot she was very nice um so i wish they were a little longer i was hoping for a little longer but i never estimate the length correctly so here we go we're at the final stage of filing it down so yeah she was so hospitable they're not normally like that she was asking name everything she was just so hospitable i really enjoyed having my nails done with her and i intend to go back to her in the future so these are the final thing as i said love them i wish the drawn on tip was a little thinner and that they were a little longer but overall i love them a lot so yeah all right guys so it's now 4 43 i've been up since 7 30 i am exhausted because as i said i'm not used to waking up early and stuff but my eyebrows are done and i got my nails done i love them they're so cute they look so mature i always think that like a friend set is so uh, mature so these were nice and the price wasn't bad and she was so nice and friendly and i really liked the receptionist and they tried to find your name and she was asking me when is your anniversary and what you're doing for christmas and you know as i i love i love good customer service when it's my turn i try to give good customer service and i love to receive good customer service because everybody wants to feel appreciated and like they matter and uh, um especially when you are spending your money something is passing right so especially when you are spending your money everybody wants to feel like they are appreciated that they matter and i felt that and as i said love my nails love my nails <laughs> clicky clack 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 so um yeah so i did not i didn't take the bag from aldo i don't know like 
I love Aldo bags, love Aldo bags, love everything Aldo to be very honest. But um that it just not jumping out at me. Maybe because I had the Tory Birch one in mind, but the Tory Birch one is not in the budget, my love. But let us see. Um I didn't get through at the Victoria's Secret either because I have a coupon that I want to use but I wanted something from Pink and Victoria's Secret. Now in some malls they are in the same building but in some malls they are beside, they are separate. So sorry about that. In this one they are separate so it wouldn't make any sense. I'd end up spending more money and you know working with the budget. We're keeping it budget friendly. So Rabs is gonna pick me up. I'm not hungry because I'm still kind of full from the Chick fil A. I don't eat a lot, so I'm probably not gonna eat anything until probably later, later tonight. So Rabs is gonna pick me up. He said he, there was an accident, he wasn't the one in the accident, so he said it's slowing him up a bit. So he's coming to pick me up and um, he's gonna take me to the Victoria's Secret because I kind of want I want to go tomorrow, but I kind of want to take it out of the way and just get it over with, right? Because tomorrow i know i'm gonna sleep in i know i'm gonna sleep in and then it's saturday and everybody and them granny want to go to the mall tomorrow and me i can't take the crowd i can't take the crowd i can't take the crowd you know so it start giving me anxiety it start giving me anxiety when i see too many people i'm like mm -mm, i can't take it because mm -mm, covid is no joke so I'm not fearful. I'm not afraid to go anywhere and whatever. But you see, I try to be careful. I'm out. I'm not wearing a mask now because I'm outside waiting on him. But if I'm going inside anywhere or whatever, I sanitize. Okay, my sanitizer. I wash my hands. I try to wear my mask and everything. So today was overall a good day. It's one of those days that I like. I mean, anything self-care related is me, and I'm a love that. So. That I was able to get the my eyebrows they actually feel good because um, the first time they felt so taut and tight and whatever but no it does feel normal so love that for me love that for me and even the nail tech she was commenting on how nice the look and stuff so love that for me looking forward to doing my lashes if these grow out by the two weeks then i'm gonna come back and get a refill but yeah i wear work with this for christmas period poo where yeah. so um so yeah yeah um i don't know if i'm gonna be able to vlog in victoria city because my battery is dying and my battery dying so often these days I, it's, it's a sign we need the iphone 13 it's a sign is a sign i think it's my sign to get the iphone 13 but i don't know when that will be so yes it was so fun carrying you guys along today and um i hope this come together like i'm having mine so yeah bye